spill your mind Give me all your reasons to why I should take my time Used to have forever but you never cared that much Okay, so it's your girl Kristen and we're back. We're doing a Sunday reset today. I wanna make sure I'm super prepared for my work week. I've been chilling real hard this weekend. Yesterday, I didn't do anything except go to lunch with my friend and do some mad relaxing and make a reel for my Instagram. So today is my day to get myself together and make sure I'm really prepared for next week. I think resetting your day and resetting your week is really important to being productive and getting a lot done. So that's what we're gonna do today and I hope you guys are looking forward to it. Hope you get some inspo. And if you're new, make sure you become a part of the community by hitting that button down there and subscribing. And if you are one of my girls, one of my one of my boys one of my homies or whatever you've been here for a while please hit the thumbs up button and show me a little bit of support but I'm gonna get changed we're gonna do a ride on the Peloton it's been a while I've been keep saying I'm going to get back at it and I haven't yet but I saw a video and my back was not looking how I wanted to look so today is the day okay we gonna get back at it I have to figure out how to fit this into my life I know I'm gonna feel better and I hope this inspires those of you who are like me and have been procrastinating to go ahead and make it happen but with no further ado I'm excited I'm so happy to be back I'm happy to talk to you guys I've missed you so much I have a vlog to edit and I pray it comes together and is okay but I'm just happy to see you guys so let's get into it let me go change real quick because I got a lot to do I still gotta do my ride I gotta get ready for the day just all those good things so I'm talking too much and I'll see y'all in just a second so we're getting back on the peloton I'm gonna pick a 15 minute ride with one of my favorites Hannah Frankson, she is such a breath of fresh air. I used to love Allie Love, which I still love Allie, but Hannah is definitely my fave. So we're gonna do Hannah and find something that's like upbeat, you know, get me in the mood, cause I'm about to try to go as hard as I can, but I just want to get my body back into it because when you first start the Peloton, the butt gonna hurt, okay? And it's really hard to pedal through your butt hurting on this bike. It's just one of those things you have to break in the butt. <laughs> You gotta break the button. <laughs> oh my gosh, I, I gotta be serious, right? <laughs> but no, you definitely have to break in your butt. <laughs> I, I just don't know what's wrong with me today. <laughs> oh my goodness, but yeah, you gotta definitely get used to it. That, that's a better way to say it. You have to get used to it, get back into the flow, so that's exactly what we're gonna do. So let's find something with Hannah, Hannah Frankson. She's from overseas too. I think she lives in like London or something like that but i'm gonna pick something hopefully new because i just love hannah she is my favorite okay so she's got a 15 minute r b ride with the cute pigtails y'all remember when i used to wear my pigtails i haven't worn my pigtails in so long i might have hair long enough to do it maybe we'll just do that one you know what we're just gonna do this r b ride let me see what the music is so it's got usher ashanti we got a little bit of scissor Tyrese and Fantasia so whatever we gonna make it work cuz I can't find no hip-hop for 15 minutes with my girl so it is what it is I can tell you my problems meditating my silence but I keep pushing my pen rotating my stylus brokenness feeling like seeing not no Creflo dollar used to be left on red now all the girls go holler now all the girls go follow all the fake friends gon' pile up I need peace to borrow Get that shit right back tomorrow Somehow all the fans go bravo Smile so much to hide my sorrow Stay this shaky in Verado I can't hold the frown too long I can't stay down too long I can't hold the frown too long I can stay down too long Running from pain, running from strain Running from things, running from schemes Couple things I show, couple things I don't. 
There is nothing like an ice cold drink after an intense workout. So I'm making some ice cubes from my high cozy. Oh my gosh, I had to tell you guys about this because first of all, you can get fresh ice cubes in less than five minutes, but it's not just any ice cube. It's the cute little square ones that go so great for crunching, but at the same time, they're not overpowering to your drink. I love these and I'm so excited to have this new machine from High Cozy, which is on Amazon. So you can also get one of these for yourself. They are just, again, very convenient. And if you want to hook it directly up to your water supply, you can do that as well, which can be convenient for those of you who want to make it a permanent piece of equipment wherever you'd like to locate it in your kitchen. Or if you're like me and you want to have the flexibility to put it wherever you can, you can also put the water directly into the machine and it will create your new fresh ice cubes in just a couple of minutes. So I want to thank Hi Cozy for sponsoring today's video. I am in love. I've already used my machine a few times and I have to tell you guys, it is super dope. So if you decide to get one, definitely come back and let me know. I did see that Amazon is running a 20% off coupon right now on their site. So definitely go over and check it out and let me know what you guys think. Hey y'all, so it's a little bit later. I have been basically just taking my time getting ready. I took the most amazing longest shower ever. Felt so good. I never get to take showers like that anymore. So I just soaked it all the way up, put my little lotion on, put my perfume, my body spray. I also did my makeup and fixed my baby hairs and got a little outfit together. So I feel so much better and very relaxed. But now we're gonna go to the grocery store. We're headed to Kroger to get some stuff to make a baked pasta. I think I'm gonna do baked penne or maybe even baked ziti, depending on how I'm feeling. So we'll see when we get there, but that's the goal. Probably we'll also get some stuff to make lunch next week. I really would like to do a salad. I wanna do that salad I always do with the chicken off the smoker. I wanna have obviously lettuce. I wanna have my blue cheese, my mandarin oranges, my garlic expressions dressing, and my bacon bits and whatever else I can think of to put over the top of this thing. But I love doing that because it's not a lot of calories, tastes good, and the mix of like the garlic and the oranges and the cheese. Oh, it's so good so don't sleep on it but let's go ahead and head out um, and get there since I want to watch the love is blind reunion for the evening have you guys been watching it oh my gosh it's kind of crazy so I want to see the actual reunion and what happened I have to admit I was crying when one of the couples didn't end up working out I don't want to spoil which one so I'm not gonna say it in case you haven't been watching but I cried for her like I really cried I was I was sad I felt very bad because I could definitely empathize with what she's going through and I'm an empath so I'm gonna cry if I see you crying it's just how I am like I just I'll be feeling for you I'll be wanting to give you a hug <laughs> so that's at five o'clock the market opens at six and I want to also have my charting and stuff done for the week so I got a lot of things I want to do so we got to hurry up and get back here so we can cook and get into it I'm sorry you cannot go with me to the grocery store <laughs> He saw me get my purse and he thinks he's supposed to go. I'm sorry you can't go, buddy. I'm sorry. No, no, no. <laughs> he thinks he's supposed to go. Mm -mm. It ain't happening, baby. Hey, girl. Hi. Hi, Loa. Hello, baby. Hey, y'all. So I'm in the whip and I'm headed to the grocery store, as I mentioned earlier. I need a remedy for the little creases I get right here. They're so annoying. Like, I do my makeup. I try to wait a little bit because I know the creases are coming. And then my makeup settles a little bit. And then, boom, they're here. So, if you guys have, like, a remedy to fix those little um, creases that come in your makeup, other than just having to wait and then taking some more powder and, like, blending it out, let us just know. Because it's frustrating. It's annoying. I hate it. <laughs> it is the one thing I haven't quite figured out yet other than, like I said, waiting 10 minutes and then coming back behind with some more powder and most of the time I forget until I've already like left the house or I'm not near my powder and it's just too late to go back and you know clean it up so I would love to hear you guys' thoughts or feedback on like what you do if you have the same issue I think I'm just getting to the age where I have those very fine lines and wrinkles and they're starting to show and they're just terribly annoying 
and frustrating you feel me like oh my gosh but I am blessed to be the age that I am I'm not complaining by any means because I know a lot of people didn't make it here so what we not gonna do is complain about it okay we gonna be happy because at the end of the day I don't feel no younger than I felt 10 years ago it's just that 10 years have passed and obviously Mr. Gravity has had his way with me and everybody else <laughs> So we're almost to the store. I just am going to try to be very quick when I get in here. I do need to add, uh, get some feminine products. I will say a day like today doing this video, it's like, you know, y'all know what day one is like. It's not fun. <laughs> so I'm trying to stay in good spirits, but I'm definitely not, I'm not happy about it. Man, they have this cute fiddly fig. I'm so tempted to take it home and put it in my office. Hmm, do I need another one? And does it look good or is there bugs in there? I really like these plants. To get it or not to get it? Okay you guys, I think I'm all done, but look at these products I found. I saw these in an ad a while back and I've wanted to try them for some time. So this is a co-wash. We've also got this cream, twist and curl cream. I think I said cream twice, but you get the point. <laughs> And then this is supposed to be like a wash and go, one product, five day curl foaming glaze. I'm really excited to try this. I actually want to see this in my kids' hair. So I will let you guys know what I think of these products, but they kind of look really dope. And the ad I also saw and the reviews I've seen have been really positive. So maybe I'll do my own review. Y'all let me know in the comments if you want to see it or not. grocery store I've got my dinner in the oven so I'm feeling really really productive right now <laughs> it's a uh, six o'clock or it's actually 6 44 here on Sunday evening um, but basically yeah dinner's almost done we got some garlic bread in the oven that's about to go off on timer and I am itching to get in the office because I really want to look at the stock market and see what's going on and then I also want to do some pre-work for my job tomorrow I have a really really early meeting um, anyways I got laundry going, I got a lot of stuff going on right now, but we're gonna go ahead and make our way to the office so we can do some charting for the night and then just kind of wrap the evening up and see what this food is looking like here in a few minutes. and excuse me trying to get ready for the week looks like this week is gonna be very fun <laughs> last week was fun too but uh, this week looks like it's gonna be a lot of fun so I'm really excited to say the least I think that we're gonna be green tomorrow we had a really nice gap up um, from the week so when you end the week you will have like the price that was printed for the end of the week and then when you start the new week on Sunday night 
um, at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, you may have a gap up or down. So we gapped up tonight, which is always very exciting to see. I was kind of hoping we gap down, but gapping up is so cool too, especially since I'm not in anything, any puts or anything like that. <laughs> But anyways, let me finish doing my charting for the week and then I will catch up with you guys in a minute. I made it to the room it's time to wind down for the evening you hear some snoring I have to first preface and say that is Jace <laughs> he is knocked out like all the way knocked out but I'm gonna be doing some goals for this week I want to focus on my trading goals as well as my goals for the project that I'm working on if you guys want to see a day in the life of a project manager with me updating you guys on my current project and how that is going definitely let me know but I want to basically have my goals set up for the week so that I can make sure that I'm able to hit them as well as everything that I want to accomplish this week so I'm gonna create a to-do list so that I can do just that I love to use my iPad to do things like this because it's really helpful to just do everything electronically I don't have to worry about having paper and notebooks and where do I put those things I just do everything inside of my OneNote notebook and it just helps me to keep it very organized as well as I can reference back to it and do search and all that good stuff so for someone like me it's very 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 beneficial and I think the part I love the most about it is that I'm able to access it on my iPad as well as I can get I can get to it on my work computer as well as my personal computer too so if you haven't found OneNote notebooks definitely check them out I am NOT sponsored by them in any way shape or form it's just an application that I love and I've been using for a really 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 long time so before you get into your Monday make sure you make your list you can do it on your phone too using your phone notes and it doesn't have to be a long list it can literally be a couple of things you want to make sure you focus on for the week and just keep looking back to it most of the time honestly I do it on my phone and I look at it on my iPad and I look at it on my computer but wherever it works for you whatever you know process whether it be paper phone notebook make just make sure you do something so you can keep track of it because it's like they say out of sight out of mind or write the vision make it plain you know what I'm saying it's just something about being intentional with everything that you do but with that I'm gonna go ahead and get up out of here so I hope you guys have enjoyed my Sunday reset the only thing I didn't show is me doing my prep for the work week but that's okay I figured I've shown you guys enough so I hope you have definitely enjoyed this video and if you want to see more videos like this where I kind of walk you guys through my thought process and things like this definitely let me know in the comment section but with that I will see you guys next time and I appreciate you and I love you as always so you guys have a great evening and make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any of my videos in the future bye